That was the longest 420 of my life. Yo. Hey, you're in 2F, right? What's with that wary look in your eye? I'm Kenji Tomachika. We're in the same class. Morning. Yeah, yeah you too. I heard from Iori that you're pretty close with Takabasan. Oh, here we go again. Is that true? Well, I guess it doesn't matter. I'm looking for someone with a little more experience anyway. Now we're already getting in into that part of your character, huh? Oh, crap. It's almost time for the morning assembly. Come on, we better hurry. That concludes the main portion of today's assembly. Next, we'll hear a word from the student council. Please welcome the new president, Mitsuru Kirijo, from Class 3D. Thank you. So she did get elected. Well, I guess she is the most popular girl in school. You can say that again. She's got this intimidating vibe around her. Not to mention, this school's owned by the Kirijo group, right? As I begin my term as student council president, I'd like to share with you my vision for this coming year. It is my firm belief that each of us must accept the responsibility of bettering our school. However, change cannot occur without sustained effort and an unprecedented level of commitment. That is why we must restructure our daily lives in order to rise to this challenge. I'd like each of you to dig deeply into your well of motivation and reevaluate your convictions. Strive to imagine a bold new future without losing sight of the realities around you. That is the key. My own ideas are but one person's vision. For us to reap the full benefits of our education, your participation, opinions, and enthusiasm are essential. Mitsuru, I love what you're putting down right now, but I'm just saying I've seen opinions on the internet before, so only with the, just say opinions within reason which they rarely are, but like, I'm, you're, you're just opening some floodgates right now, is all I'm saying. Thank you. Dang, what a speech. Do you, uh, have any idea what she just said? <laughs> Junpei's new voice actor does pr uh, pretty darn good at his delivery, I gotta say. Sorta. Sure didn't sound like something a high schooler would say. If there was anyone else, We'd be laughing our asses off. I love the little ticking clock. Okay, time for class. All right, today we'll be looking at some Meiji era literature. Open your textbooks to page 12. You know what? I'm sick of this story. I already went over it in the last class. Oh, so the last class learned it, but then you're not going to teach us it? That, okay, sure. Yeah, um, can we get this chick fired? I've got a great poem we can discuss instead. Close your textbooks, everyone, and listen to this. Hey, is the thing that you're skipping over gonna be on the exam? Like, isolated clouds suspended over the tall, snowy mountain peak. Okay, yeah, poetry is boring. I'll say it. Sorry to all poetry enjoyers in chat. But, like, come on. I'm feeling sleepy. I, oh, man, I am tempted to just fall asleep right now, but I, I will stay awake. What even? Hey, Kenji, you'd better not be sleeping back there. You should be ashamed of yourself napping while I pour my heart into this reading. You're getting another essay on top of the regular assignment tonight. All right, good thing I stayed awake. I expect a slice of cake when you turn it in, too. All right, so... Why why does the Persona universe... Like, do they not know what a normal teacher is? I'm not convinced this woman is a teacher. You know what, chat? I'm with you. I'm not convinced she's a teacher either. Maybe she just showed up one day. Don't cheap out with the store-bought stuff like last time. You expect this student to bake a cake for you? I forced myself to stay awake and listen to that. I, hey, man. I, I still got academics for it. Good enough. Academics is the most important stat because I think you have to have either level 4 or level 5 academics to start Mitsuru's social link way later in the game. Want to stop by Paulonia Mall on the way back? It's Paulonia, not Polonia? I hate it. I hate it a lot. Baking a cake isn't that hard, to be honest. But you're expecting a dude who has probably never made a cake before to buy the things necessary for a cake. 
look up a recipe on like how to do it or like a YouTube how to, or you know, he might just be able to do it by reading off the back of the cake mix box. And then to take the time to create said cake, which is going to require making much cake, not just one slice of cake, instead of just going and buying you a slice at the store, it's ridiculous. That's like, it's not like making a cake is really that hard, but it's so much more work and effort than just buying a slice of cake at the store. Might wanna stock up while we can, since we got stuff going on at night. There's a pharmacy there too. Couldn't hurt to get some meds in case anything happens. You seem uh, really into this, bro. You bet I am. If we don't step up to the plate, who will? The chairman said it himself. The fate of the world depends on us. Man, I'm I'm having a great time playing Persona 3 again, and so far this remake seems really good. Like the gameplay seems smoother, game just looks so much nicer. It just it it seems for the most part just just a straight upgrade, more or less. Playing it and like having Junpei talk about like baseball stuff like step up to the plate really makes me want to go through the arena story again because man I loved arena story. Let's go, leader. First task, escape from the school. Have you noticed how popular Sonata-san is with the ladies? Man, take a look at that. I guess neither of us really got to know him before all this crazy stuff happened. He's a captain of the boxing team. Never lost a single match. I know that's cool and all, but who'd have thought boxing would turn you into a chick man? I think it's more than just the boxing. I mean, come on. They're fawning on him more than a harem manga. I wonder where they're going. How often do you read harem manga? Just wondering. Hey, are you guys free this afternoon? I totally forgot that Akihiko never takes this bandage off of the top left of his head. <laughs> Why is it always there? Does like does he take it off like after a week that whatever hurt him there wears off and he takes it off, but then immediately he gets injured there again somehow every time? I mean, hell yeah. We love to join your little, uh, group here. Yeah, what about our shopping? We can shop later. Well, are you free or not? Yeah, of course. No problemo. I want the two of you to meet me at Polonia Mall. You know where it is, right? I'll be waiting at the police station. You said it like I say it, right? Polonia, not Paulonia? I want the two of you to meet me at Polonia Mall. Yeah, he says Polonia. Why did Junpei say Paulonia? I hate it here. Got it? Yeah, the police station? You mean, we're not hanging out with your friends? Who, these girls? <laughs> Look at Akihiko's face in this portrait. <laughs> No, I don't even know their names. Hearing so much chit chat gives me a headache. <laughs> Dang, bro. Stone cold. Jace Truewing, thank you for something with Prime for four months. Greatly appreciated. Thank you for the support. Anyway, I'm going on ahead. Don't keep me waiting. Wait, Senpai, don't leave us. He doesn't even know your name, girl. You are literally thin student to him. Why they run like that? Man, how can he not know their names? I mean, seriously, just look at them. Uh, anyway, let's go. Sonata asked us to meet him at the Polonia Mall police station. Junpei and I decided to head over. Yeah. Well, I was just heading there myself. You know the place, right? Let's go. I'm waiting for my boyfriend. We're going to Hagakure. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Good for you. You know how every school has at least one mystery no one can solve? There's one here too, you know? Like the sculpture in the art room that moves by itself. 
It sounded cooler in my mind. Okay. How's the remake? It's pretty darn good so far, I'd say. Pretty good. We're still like really, we're in the classic JRPG opening bit still a little bit. Especially in a Persona game. Like all JRPGs have that like hour or two at the start where like, you know, you're going through tutorials and set up and like world building, etc. And in Persona games, they do double that. Instead of the JRPG standard like hour or two, it's like two to four hours. So, you know, we're, we're getting through it though. Everywhere you look, you see young couples. Well, what are you waiting for? Go after someone. You're still young. You've got no excuse not to be together with some girl. All right, that, you know, that hurts me personally as a person. So please stop that, Atlas. I beg of you. No. This is the place Sonata-san was talking about, right? All right, want to go in? Let's go. Thank you, Kurosawa-san. I'll be taking this. Yo, Kurosawa-san, let's go! Oh, these are the guys I was talking about earlier. <sighs> this is Officer Kurosawa. He helps keep our squad well-equipped. Oh, and here, this is from Ikutsuki-san. $5,000? Yo! This does not make up for the awful puns he makes me listen to. Whoa, is that our warp buns? This shouldn't have. You can't fight empty-handed, so find something you like. Kurosawa-san has connections. He can secure equipment for us. But these things still cost money. Of course they do. Nothing in life is free. Breathing? I realize that. Well, I'll see you later. Thanks again. I've been informed about you two. My job is to maintain peace in this city regardless of the circumstances. I'm just an ordinary police officer, but it doesn't take a genius to know something strange is going on here. Shout out to Kurosawa, cool dude. Deadball, thank you for gifting 10 tier 1 subs to the channel. 143 gifted subs total on the channel. Thank you so much, brother. Thank you for the support. Everyone who got a gift sub, enjoy. I'm only doing what I think is right. Nothing more. If you need something, we can talk in the back. All right. Now then, I don't have that much, but you should be able to find what you need. At Tatsumi East Police Station, you can purchase equipment for you and your party to use in battle. You can also sell any equipment you aren't using if you need a little extra cash. There's no telling what dangerous Tartars will throw your way, so be sure to gear up. Equipment is listed in four categories. Weapons, armor, footwear, and accessories. Oh yeah, footwear. Weapons primarily influence attack damage. Armor reduces damage taken. Footwear affects the wearer's evasiveness, and accessories grant the wearer various special effects. Do you think... Do you think the high cut armor is still in this game, chat, but now in HD? I guess we'll find out, won't we? Sometimes equipment other than accessories will also grant special effects. Try out different combinations to optimize and specialize your loadout. Uh huh. Got some new things in stock. What are you looking for? Take as long as you need. It's the same for everyone. Okay, cool, cool. Footwear. Uh -huh. Take as long as you need. Casual boots with thick soles. I think we're gonna buy anything as as right now. You know, we'll save our money for a little bit. As as you need. The pixie dust talisman. Plus 10 SP. Micro sash. Yeah, I mean, we, we don't need anything immediately, I don't think. A curved, easy to use sword for Minato. The rainbow. Oh, that's just a rude sword. Yeah, we're just gonna hold off for now. You finished? All done here? All done here? Hmm? You finished? Hmm? You finished? This is Gara, isn't it? This sounds like Akihiko. Hmm? You finished? Did they get him to voice Kurosawa? Uh, chat, yeah, chat is literally saying it's Gara's voice actor. Gara also voiced the original Akihiko. Got 
come back soon. If you want to buy anything, you know where to find me. Drop by anytime. I can't believe the police station's selling weapons. What's more? They only gave us 5,000 yen. Ain't that kind of stingy? I mean, what kind of save in the world? Oh crap, it's this late already? I'm gonna miss the rerun of the Lonely Shogun. I gotta go. The Lonely Shogun? Is that a harem anime? Okay. Sweet. I'll leave the rest to you. I know, I'm the one who brought you here, but if you see me again, you know where. There's a ton of shops and stuff in this place, so you really should check it out while you can. All right, see you back at the dorm. To the stat arcade, away! Starting today, you're free to use your after school hours however you wish. Oh, we're almost out of tutorial land, chat. Making use of various school facilities or visiting certain spots in town can raise academics, charm, or courage. However, the number of activities you can engage in each day is limited. Think carefully about how to spend your time and plan ahead. I wonder if Knight is as bereft of social links in this game as is the original. I'm pretty sure I saw people talking about how the uh, they gave the guys some social link stuff in this game, similar to how they got in Portable, but I don't know. I didn't see anything specific about it, so. When you turn on network functions, you can review online player statistics. We're not gonna do that. There's a Velvet Room symbol there. Game Parade. Game Parade. You can partake in the services offered by various establishments in town, but doing so will cause time to pass. Many businesses will raise social stats. High stats may help you form new relationships. Various arcade games are inside. Depending on what game you play at the arcade, you can increase academics, charm, or courage, or a stat to your equipped persona. The arcade cycles through which games are available each day of the week. Time will pass regardless of what game you play. Boom, boom, boom. I'm pretty sure this was like the best option in Persona 3 to raise statistics, if I'm not mistaken. So, I'm just gonna immediately do that. Oh, they actually show you playing a game. That's funny. In the original, they didn't do that. Atlas, 1998. Space World. Is that like an actual Atlas game from back in the day, I wonder? I'm surprised it's not an SMT. I played the horror game, House of the Deceased. I saw many gruesome scenes, but managed to calmly defeat all of my enemies. Yo, two courage notes. Did you turn on Persona memory? I'm pretty sure I did. I think I did. Did you buy any DLC? No, I have not bought any DLC. Welcome back. Perfect timing. I'd like to speak to you for a moment. I'll give you my entire night. Regarding our exploration of Tartarus, Akihiko is still on the mend, so for now, I'd like you to lead the team in combat. You never know when a powerful enemy might appear, like the one you faced the other day. Well, I know when they'll appear. It's the full moon every time. It's best to be prepared, or else you may find yourself in a difficult situation. So whenever you'd like to explore Tartarus, just let me know, and I'll gather everyone there. You may now venture into Tartarus at your discretion. You can go there by talking to your allies, or by checking the bulletin board in the lounge. Because Tartarus is unavailable until the dark hour, time will pass if you decide to make the journey. Give yourself ample time to prepare beforehand. Oh, right. Also, since I'm sure there are other things you will need to take care of, you have permission to go out at night if you need to. That's all for now. Keep up the good work. 